Let's um, away from footballing matters as the old world is going to gather in Qatar, form in front of the um, TV, uh, some wherever they are, and they've been big um, uh, uh, um, TVs. Um, media platforms across um, Lagos where you can watch um, on the street or some places where you can watch the top place match um, between um, Croatia and um, Morocco. Away from football, we'll go to athletics. Um, Nigeria is never, never short of talent in every area of sport and athletics is not um, far from that. At the just concluded 2022 National Sport Festival um, in Asaba, um, we have a certain Stella Anyon Leke, who perhaps might be the next time, Toby Amosa. She did something incredible at the 100 meters audios at the Stephen Keshi Stadium in Asaba. She won the gold medal of that um, particular event. And that's just a day after she was informed she never knew she was going to come for the for that event. When she was called upon, she came a day before our event and she won the gold medal, defend, defeating the defending champion um, that won it in Edo 2022. So enjoy this race. And um, that's why we're asking the question um, before you see it elsewhere, that we actually told the world there's a certain Stella and young Leke who perhaps might be the next to be Amosa. Enjoy this um, 100 meters on this race and um, our interview afterwards. I'm so happy for making this because God really made it a reality for me. I'm so glad. Coming out there, I just, I was just unusually calm. I don't know, I was just unusually calm. I knew that I was going to come here to do something really amazing. Coming here yesterday, I just, I was actually really tired. But I just had to like come. I, when I came yesterday, I just did some little warm ups to just get my body active. and. Stella Anyoleke doing so well. She represented um, Lagos State um, Athletics. She was a gold medalist in the Nougat Games. Uh, I think she was representing Unalag. And um, before representing Delta this particular um, year, she has been um, um, representing Lagos State. But she was in the last edition in Edo 2020 because of her arm fracture. So she's here and she's doing so well. And um, Hopefully, we might see the next um, Toby Amosa also coming from Lagos, um, from Lagos, and I'm um, hoping that um, we'll get so much of many of them across that. And it was still on athletics, but not um, the 100 meters all those is the short put and not forgetting the discourse. Foreign based Nigerian athletes came to Edo 2022 for the National Sport um, Festival. Um, you see them walking together and um, some represented Delta State, while some um, River State, and they actually made record at the just concluded 2022 um, National Sport Festival in, um, in Asaba. We have um, Chube Kuka, also we have um, Stella, and not forgetting um, Shade Olatoye, who won gold medal. And it's interesting to know that um, there's also a Commonwealth gold medalist among them, talking about Yekwewe, and also the African, that's Chibwe Buka, the African um, record, um, African champion in the this um, short spot. So it's about, and they all came to represent the various, um, not the various state where they come from, but state that showed interest in, in each they represented, like I said, Delta and Rivers. Enjoy this. The uh, festival is always a difficult meet, so last time I came was 2018. I set records in the shot put as well as the hammer throw, and this time around I set the national record in the hammer throw. I'm very excited about that. Hopefully I'll set another national sports festival record in the shot put. I'm happy with how I'm performing. 
under difficult conditions? Um, so the experience has been it's been all right. Uh, being able to come here, uh, place gold uh, in the women's hammer and the women's shop it has been great. Um, I know that I'm still in the in the beginning of my training stage since I'm still preparing for indoor season. So seeing the marks marks that I had here um, is just an indication that there's more to come. Um, the competition has been all right. Uh, you know, seeing competitors I saw last year at national trials, see them doing better has been really good. Uh, seeing that there's progress, so that's good for the, uh, the future of Nigerian sports, and I hope that continues for everybody. My first national sports festival, I was excited to compete and come back. Um, it's been good time training after the end of the season, so I'm glad to be back and shake off some of the rust and be able to be back in Nigeria. Yeah, so I've just been training. I've done some competition. The only time I've represented Nigeria was for the um, 2019 All-African Games in Morocco. Um, but this is the second time I'm coming back and um, competing. So, yes. It was amazing. I can't believe that so many people were supporting me and just cheering me on. Um, two of my aunties here in Asaba, they even came to support me. And I threw my best because everybody was here for Interesting moments that just concluded the National Sport Festival in Asaba. And uh, we know that Ogun State will host the next edition in, um, in Abelkuta for the 2024 um, National Sport Festival. 2024 National um, Sports Festival because it's a biennial um, sport um, competition. And um, I know obviously that um, what is the everybody's mind is today third place match between Croatia and then Morocco. And also tomorrow's final, Qatar 2020 has come to an end and we have two people and out of those two people, one person has to be the winner. And don't forget, both our former champions, fans have won that before, uh, twice. And yeah, if I'm not mistaken on that, but we know that um, um, we had um, we had um, Argentina winning it um, more than once. We have um, Diego Maradona. So Messi, it's time to make history. Some say it's going to be a very patting um, record for, for, for Messi. Earlier, we had um, the general manager of um, Radio Lagos Equip from Olaji Dilawa, who gave us his unbiased analysis on the third place match and also the final tomorrow. So I'll be leaving you um, as a wrap up for today's program, leaving you with. Um, the road to the final, um, our Argentina go to the final of um, the World Cup. Thank you for watching. I still remain Mundashi Shitu. Same time next week, we'll be giving you all what you need to know in the world of sport. Bye for now and enjoy this wonderful um, road of our Argentina go to the final of um, the Qatar 2022 World Cup.